We're out, out here today, uh, our great Frontier Squadron from the 278th ACR. They're out here showcasing uh, some of their equipment and some of their soldiers uh, for a very distinguished crowd of folks from the 36th ID, Texas Military Department, as well as some of our elected officials. This is an opportunity to showcase not only their equipment and their mission, but their fantastic soldiers in front of a, a group of distinguished visitors. 128 steel tungsten balls that are one inch in diameter. We're actually transforming as a division. So we are transforming from 36 Infantry Division uh, to a heavy division. We'll be the only heavy division in the National Guard. It's been over 20 years since we've had tanks. The soldiers out here, they're just enjoying the opportunity uh, to have an opportunity to fire armor again. It's, it's extra special uh, to see heavy armor again. I, I, I'm so impressed to see the, uh, uh, the guardsmen here uh, that know so much about, uh, about their mission, uh, they know so much about their equipment, and uh, they are serving their country well. It's kind of a dance. I mean, these guys are all very proficient in their crew stations on the tank, but they have to work completely in concert with each other. There's so many moving parts on that thing, and, and, and it, it's, it's a beast. And those guys are very proficient. They know their job, they know the other crew members' jobs, and, and it's just like a choreographed dance for them. And, and when they're really good, and you can see them out here, it's, it's a thing to behold. It's, uh, it's why we are the best uh, military in the world. The first time we've able to pull these tanks out, put rounds down range, and do our job. All these people came here, we volunteered for this. It's, it's what we got here for, it's what we enlisted for. It's what we fight for our country for. And what makes it great for me is that I get to see the excitement in their face. You know, they, this is what they joined the Army to do. It's what they joined the Guard to do. They joined to be part of a team, and their team's out here doing what they do. If you want to see teamwork here, we think about it on the football field. I challenge anyone to come see better teamwork than what you'll see here. So they're working their fire command right now. Here it goes. Uh, when the breach comes back, uh, you, you better you better watch out. It is it's a powerful force. I mean, the G forces on that thing, uh, where it, it's something you you never get tired of. Um, the entire you're you're hearing it in your CVC and your helmets. Um, you're feeling the movement in your entire body. Uh, your whole crew, everybody's experiencing it. It's it's one of the most exciting things through gunnery we experience. That that boom is. Oh, it's the best sound ever. I mean, that's the sound of freedom, right? The boom just today to hear these tanks uh, actually execute and fire that main gun, that's a, an adrenaline rush like no other. And uh, if that don't get you going, you know nothing will. Anytime you get to come out here and fire big rounds and make things go boom, it's awesome. And so they're having a blast. Uh, over the last year, uh, our battalion uh, has done extraordinarily uh, preparing for this, uh, for this day in particular uh, to be able to send rounds down range. And so again, this better prepares us not only to integrate with uh, 278, uh, but more importantly, the nation and our active duty counterparts. We want to be ready to go when the call is needed.